All right, everybody, here we go. The Super Smash Bros. Ultimate game was recently honored with five awards at this year's Japan Game Awards. It's received a great many awards on top of that as well. Let's get it. Each award is very meaningful to me. Damn. So I would like to take Yo, the opportunity actually, to explain my thanks actually to all those who have voted nah, and to he all deserves those it. who have supported us. Anyway, the MBS, as it was called then, was sold in various places, and for an arcade machine, it wasn't all that expensive. Yeah, this is like you watching a YouTube video that like Sakurai made. Like we're watching like Sakurai's That's YouTube channel. You <laughs> lots of ca Next, let's talk about what Fatal Fury is. You know what's funny is that Sakurai is like educating all the Smash kids that don't Street know Fire about these two. games. <laughs> Actually, this video was recorded about one month prior to its release. Oh! I want to make sure I present Terry to you in such a way that you can fully understand his appeal. He seems so complicated, you. right? Like, I feel like he's explaining yeah. so okay, much that begin. he might be very complicated. He, they didn't do this for real and Ken, you know? Terry Bogard joins the battle. Here we go, here we go. This is Terry Bogard in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. He's still wearing an outfit that reflects the era of his original game, right. but we did our best to make him look cool in a variety of ways. When he stands next to Ryu, it almost makes you wonder, is this really a Super Smash Brothers game? He's Doesn't about it? as tall as Ryu. Yeah. Just like Ryu, when you're playing one-on-one, -on -one, he'll face the opponent. Okay. Actually, he always looks in the So they have direction. the same mechanic Even as Ryu can. Even if you move to a location behind the opponent, he'll quickly turn around, always keeping his focus on the opponent. Let's talk about his moves. A lot of people are disappointed. His attacks are jab, body blow, and high kick. Ooh, okay. That's very fluid Each animation. Move is something familiar from the Fatal Fury series. Can he combo off of them? And he his should dash be able to. is power charge. Ooh, that's a good dash attack. This is a move you can use in real bout Fatal Fury special and others. Has in a the weak power spot and then a strong hand. Special moves. His tilt attacks are middle kick, rising upper. Okay, anti aerial and under. So pretty much down to the same as Ryu can really. Compared to Ryu, his attack speed is slower. Right? This is to match his original series. Mmm. Very specific with it. So they, they care now more about like a uh, familiar First up, transition, back right? Backspin kick. Okay. This smash attack is the equivalent to his strongest. A lot of range because the motion forward. is even cooler than in his original series. Next, wild upper and slide kick. Down smash looks Both pretty good. It'll dodge some series. Then his midair moves. Jump, then chop. Oh, that move has jump, no range. Quarter, backer, definitely jump, looks like the main aerial. Then backward kick. And then somersault kick. That has range. However, this somersault kick was not included in the original series. But we needed a move to attack up. So we created a new move. <laughs> so they made it, bro. They're like, we'll just make it. Also, jump and then karate punch. Very similar to Rion Ken, to be honest, if guys. If you successfully pull off a down air, it's possible to attack with a meteor effect, as you can see here. Okay. It's basically like views. Next, I'll cover his throws. His forward throw is his familiar buster throw. His back throw is also buster throw. Tech chase. And his down throw is neck breaker drop. That's that, that gotta be a combo throw. That looks like a combo throw right there. In fact, he used it in the game Fatal Fury, Wild Ambition. I miss playing that game on Hyper Neo Geo 64. And then his up throw is grasping upper. This sort of that could also be a combo throw. Performed after a spot dodge. I mentioned dodge attacks, and this actually does exist. During a spot dodge, immediately press the button to counter attack. Oh wait, so he has a, he has like a, like a During like a, a like a command. Your upper body becomes Post invincible, dodge. so this oh. kind of move gives you the advantage when you. Wait, that's attack. really good because spot dodging is so broken in ultimate. So now that's actually really tactics. useful. Like a technical counter of sorts. His neutral special with just the B button is power wave. That has range. Very good to force people to jump. That's good. That's a good Depending neutral. Depending on how long you press Very the good. button, you'll use one of two types of special attacks: weak and strong. Mm -hmm. For the mix up, this one is weak and kind right. of slow, and this one is strong. Oh, that's a guy like projectile. It? That's actually For a guy like projectile. In his original game, you used three buttons, so there were weak, medium, and strong attacks. For Terry Bogard, you could use four buttons in his original game, oh. but there were only two buttons for punch. 
So that's why he only has two attack levels, weak and strong. This right. rule applies to all of his special attacks, so please keep that in mind. Oh, okay. By the way, so all of his attack power is a move great. that shoots energy along the ground. But how does it look in the air? In his original game, you couldn't use this move in the air. Uh huh. This is how it looks now. As of the King of Fighters 96, that could be good to edge guard, but doesn't have shorter range, it is. so we've recreated that version of the move. It's a useful move in midair and helps keep opponents in check. You can definitely camp with it for sure. That's Next, pretty good. We actually. have a special Never mind. That's pretty good. Holding in the direction of your opponent, burning knuckles. Side B. This move also has a weak and strong version, as well as a command input. Like the Hadoken command input from Street Fighter 2, right. you perform this command using the directional input down to the side in the direction of your opponent. But like a half circle. Doing so makes the move a bit stronger. That seems like a good move. It has a this lot of range. That burning knuckle has four variations. So far, he seems to have a runaway playstyle because he can like he can like camp with the, that guy like projectile and then has like a options to get Meet away with command input with this and strong with command input. Oh. The strong version using the command input is of course the most powerful. You'll hear a noise when you input the command. Okay. And if you've succeeded, you might also notice some green mix in the Man, look at all the small details. It may be slight, but there is a difference. The strong version with the command input really is strong, even capable of KOing Oh opponents. wait, that's really strong, bro! It can be blocked, however, so be on the lookout for that. In such a case, you'll be left wide open. That move Rio really and far this is away. The first for the Super Smash Brothers series. Okay. But the side specials are split into two versions. Uh -huh. A back special and a front special. Oh! That means there's one more side special that's than a, usual. That's super Fraction. unique. Oh! This is a familiar move from his original game. It's two side Bs. There's also a command input version. It's performed by using the directional buttons down to the back, followed by the A or B button. Okay. So quarter circle. The command version can launch your opponent quite a bit further. Ooh, that's a guy like combo starter and a guy like kick away, and it, it'll jump like through like ground movement. It creates a bit of an arc, so or, like, it can be used as an anti-air attack when your opponents try to hit you. Dude, that's guy like when people try At to jump. Range, that's a guy like. If you happen to be blocked by a shield, it's hard to be counterattacked because you'll pass through them. That's guy like. Yo, that move. There's that something move I want spam. you to remember. People are gonna spam that move. When you do a crack shoot off screen, this is how it will look. <laughs> That's how it's gonna Terry look. They want for all the Terry using burning knuckle and crack shoot, so it can be hard to recover. Right. However, if you keep pressing backwards without inputting commands, you should be able to initiate crack shoot in the direction you're trying to recover. Uh huh. Let me show you one more time. Do this, then continue to press backward. Okay. And then a little complicated recover. for sure. If you press too quickly or input some commands, you'll fly right off the stage. So be careful. <laughs> that crack is gonna be hard day one. And this bro. is it complicated. Special, rising tackle. He's got a lot of specific. It also has weak and strong versions. Each that seems like an RI right recovery. It doesn't go that far, but it could be like hard to challenge. Because he can do two specials off the level. He, he can. Charge, his recovery has more mix. Whole body though. glows a little. Oh, in if this it's ability case, at the start, no, never mind. That's pretty good. That's start. pretty good, actually. Either way, your legs will be invincible. That's Here's pretty good, actually. This invincibility in action. Invincibility and that range is With pretty good, bro. With the standard rising tackle. Oh, the range is that? I wiped out when I threw myself at them. But with rising tackle's charged command version. You oh, that's something. hit at this moment. So you come out on top. Bro, that's good. That's actually a really good up at a shield. Yeah. Except you, can, use can you do the as a command version out of, out of shield? For Rion King, you cannot. Even after using Burning Knuckle or Crack Shoot, you can still use Rising Tackle. Right. This is also very helpful when you're trying to recover. So I think his recovery is going to be pretty good, actually. His down special is Power Dunk. Oh, dude, and that's a guy like rises and descends. And for approaching, that's just a good move overall. Good mix, though. This side down diagonally down command input is also known as the Shoryuken command. Bro, that's complicated. <laughs> if you can pull it off, you'll be invincible at the start of the move. And that's guy like? Hello? Yo, he's got many invincible. Also, you can moves. hear a sound when it connects. 
That's not cool. Might be tough to make out. Now let's talk about. Dude, this is by specials. far the most difficult. I really like you to keep this in Definitely. mind. He's got a lot of things. Like, this is a very high skill. First, if you use a special character. after attacking with a standard attack, the special won't come out until the move animation has finished. Okay. That makes sense, right? Yeah. But here's what happens if you cancel out of it. Okay. So we can cancel just like Rayon can. At this moment here, if you've successfully entered a special command input, the rest of the animation will be cancelled, allowing you to attack again immediately. There you go, there's there's how the combos work. I'll do that again. Throw out a kick like normal. And once your leg extends, you'll perform the move. Dude, look at all you're gonna be able to do some crazy combos with this character, for sure. No meter so far though. Set it Chat, who's so gonna be bad with, attack, with Terry day one? Raise your hand. Special. This will increase your offensive options. Please try this out. For example, neutral attack, one, two, and power. Bro, this is a bread combo. And combo. Aside from that, oh, he can do. Oh, he's gonna be broken, bro. Fly out and attack in an M shape. He needs something. He needs the strong. In his original game, you could only cancel attacks on the ground, but in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, it's possible to cancel areas. Oh, you already know. You already know. The types of aerial attacks that you can cancel are limited to things like neutral air attacks or down air attacks. Uh huh. Not up air? But I think it would be wise to use these combos to expand your offensive options. So not from up air, only from neutral air and down air? The final smash. Okay. His final smash begins with a triple geyser. That's a lot of range. Terry will shoot three geysers straight forward. However, if you think that's all, you're very mistaken. It's gonna be an input uh, final smash. Oh! Wait, that's crazy actually. That's got a lot of range to, to just catch you. As you can see, if Triple Geyser connects, you'll follow up with Power Dunk and Buster Wolf. It's three moves in one. It's a visually striking combo. You may be wondering what happened to his original super special moves. Yes, they're here too. Okay. With the usual rules, when Terry's damage meter rises up to 100% or higher, and in stamina mode, when his overall meter! HP drops to 30% or less, you'll see this go icon at the bottom of the screen. At this point, if you enter the specific command, you can initiate the power geyser you see here. Okay, that's it? The command input is, if I borrow the way it's said in the original game, down, angle down, side, angle down, forward. Oh, okay, too complicated. Well, it's a bit complicated. <laughs> Downward, then backward, then forward. Nobody's gonna play this character right day one, bro. It is an action game after all, so you get to control the direction of your punch, be it right or left. Ah, nice. In that case, no matter which direction you're going for, just swap the right input and left input. Right. It's like this. Downward, then backward, then forward. Or down, and then the opposite direction, <laughs> that's forward. Hey, yo. And then, there's this other super special move. Oh! Wait, that did 45 Buster damage? Wolf. You can initiate this one by repeating the Hadouken command input twice. Down to side, then down to side again. It can be rather difficult to pull off moves using the original game's command inputs. Okay. But you can also use simplified command inputs. Yes? In the case of Power Geyser, remember this. Down, side, down, forward. As long as you input the command downward to the side, to the back, downward again, and then forward, you should be fine. Alright, there you go. Now In we're the case talking. Of aye, aye. Aye. It's simply down, side, down, side. That should be easier to remember. This guy is going to be difficult to play. You know, even I'm though be the bad command input is complex, it can still be blocked with ease. Since these moves can only be used when Terry has taken a lot of damage, you'll be in even more danger if your opponent blocks. So they're high risk and high return. 
please save them for when you really need to make a last ditch effort. So he gets like he gets like power every you can single time again, again much. But be careful. Your opponent may That's be actually a really fair meter mechanic cuz he just gets extra moves that are, you know, he has to work. use it to least them expect it, you know? or to cancel out of a combo like this. Mm. That's kind of broken. <laughs> for the taunts, I decided to match his original game. His up taunt is Hey, come on, come on from the King of Fighters series. His down taunt spins his hat like in the real bout series. Yo, when are they gonna and introduce his girl Terry? Stand up from Gutto, Mark of the Wolves. That's gonna be good for me. I've demonstrated him using various special moves in the game so far, and you can hear his voice. Like that. We've incorporated both his longer remarks, like Power Wave, from older titles, and his shorter remarks, like Rock You, from newer titles. And here are his colors. Oh, look at all the out. Is there a Yori There's a good variety of colors available from across the series. And the cat design is slightly different in each version. Oh, that is true. They're based on his original games, and we've also included some from the King no, of Fighters girl, 14 Terry? and the anime series. For example, it happens during his victory pose. His cap also blows away when he is defeated in stamina mode. Oh. The stage is called King of Fighters Stadium. That stage definitely not legal, yo. They got walk off, not legal. It looks like one hardcore fighting coliseum. Look, there's like uh, characters from the his series. The text above the Jumbotron reads, King of Fighters, without V. When we talk about a game title, we need V up front. But the name of the tournament in the game's story is just King of Fighters. Right. This is a very unique stage, and it follows some rules that haven't existed in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate before. Okay. First, the edge is walled off. Huh? In the Super Smash Bros. series, you need to launch opponents off the stage. Here, however, the more damage a fighter has accumulated, the more the wall will visually react uh -huh. when launched into it. Can you see? Yeah. Eventually. Oh, that's, that, that's kind of cool, right actually. We hope you'll enjoy playing at the stage with all its special rules. He was trying to do the command. <laughs> Camillos? Give me some Yuri. Give me Yuri. First up, Andy Bogart. Under Andy, Mike Andy, Andy. Father, Kung Fu Ru. He's the master of the holy fist of eight ways, Geese Howard. He's the big boss of South Yeah, Town. of course, the bad guy. And he's the rival of Terry Bogart, Blue Mary. Her first appearance was in Fatal Fury. Hello, Fury those melons? She uses combat sambo. Yo, those might be the biggest melons in Smash ever. Chok Sanagi. He's Gord the protagonist, Kyo? Oh, let's go! Originally, he was introduced as Kyo Sanagi's rival, but when I first saw this character in the game at the time, See, due that's to his my look boy. and attitude, I thought, whoever created this character must be a genius. <laughs> True Dude, there's so move. many guest characters, bro. They put like everybody. How could I not include him? <laughs> like literally everybody. So, as you can see, we've cool, included dude. many characters. A total of 20 characters. 20, bro. You know, they went so cumbersome. out there for just the little I mean, details. it takes a lot of time. But so many people love each and every one of these characters, even outside the confines of their individual series. So we simply had to do our best by them. Yo, they didn't put any Mai. By the Yo, way, no Mai, you may have bro. noticed that a very important character from the Fatal Fury series was not included. Yes, Mai Shiranui. Super Smash Bros. Ultimate is for good boys and girls of many different ages, so we decided not to feature. Oh, she was Bros. too nice looking, yo! My music oh! features a variety of tracks, and the music. Oh, we're doing this classic time, mode, I'm going daddy. To play the Terry route of classic mode. That oh, Sakura trying to play on hard. Honestly, playing the game in extreme difficulty while doing commentary is extremely hard. Yeah, see. It feels like YouTuber and doable, streamer. But doing both at once forces me to divide my attention. But uh -huh, it means I yeah. should do my best at both. Yeah, you hear that, chat? You hear that? Uh huh. Yo, I'm still salty. There's no my chat. Do you feel salty, chat? I feel salty. I like how they're following this team. Similarities. Kind of like in the mean his games where it's like a team of three. Same game. Three v three. It would be easiest to simply knock him off the screen, but I'm not going to do that because it's not as fun to watch. <laughs> He said, that's not fun to watch. Pulls, Oops, pulls out in camper. Oh. Oh, no. She didn't die. Oh, Sakurai camping. <laughs> he taunted. Oh. The table oh, Sakurai. <laughs> he almost died, yo. Oh, Sakurai. No. What are you doing? 
Oh! <laughs> I like how knowledgeable Stacker is about just, just gaming in general. I heard that in his free time, he plays lots the of games. He likes to like, just play Yusha everything. Like, he There's plays a, a lot of games, he says, a year. Just to like get inspiration and stuff and just, I don't know, just learn. He just seems knowledgeable about gaming in general. I don't know, guys, but watching Sakurai go through classic mode is one of the cutest things I've ever seen. It almost feels like we're watching a Sakurai live stream. As in like, close. like, like we're like, like in Twitch.tv slash like Master Hero Sakurai. You know, he's like just streaming from his house or something. Yo. Well, how about now? Oh, he did the special move. He having fun. It's bad to keep using the same move. Seriously. Damn, calls out and spammer. Called out all the spammers, yo. Next. Now for a scary one. Bayonetta. The scary one, Bayo. Oh. Oh, Bayo. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, Bayo. Slack Rare got wish time. Oh, he's She's getting wish so time, good. yo. Can you imagine Bayo beat Slack Rare? Please, but Bayo, let's go. Take advantage of that opportunity. Oh, dude, that's gonna be so awesome to get me if Bayo beat Slack Rare. That would have been a guy like me, yo. Next, let's talk about the music. Basically, we expanded the selection a bit to include series outside of just Fatal Fury and uh -huh. King of Fighters. We did a lot of digging around and finally managed to narrow our many candidates down to 50 songs. What? We never intended to do something like this, of course. What? So we submitted our 50 proposals to SNK, expecting them to pick out maybe 10 or 20 that they considered And they picked all of them. But they told us they were, okay. As a result, we've pretty much added in 50 songs. What? Bro, what? Have a look at the list. 50 songs? Oh my god! That's how we ended up Yo, with the last, list we have, last but we worked Final hard Fantasy to deliver some of Cloud. the best remixes. Sakura was like, hey, this was Square a very Enix, special can you give me like some, some, I don't some think Final Fantasy 7 music? Here's like a list of 50 songs. To be honest, I and think they that being able two. to hear such a selection <laughs> might make the fighters pass oh with quite god, a bit last more than its Cloud price. Stripe, yo. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> I do hope you'll enjoy it. Now for the Mii Fighters. Please have a look. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Da 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 da! Samurai Showdown? Didn't he want to add something like this in Melee? Art of Fighting? Ah, yeah. Rio. And then Papyrus. Yuri? Yes! Oh, let's go! Ooh, that theme, baby! Ooh! Alright, I got hype. I got what I wanted. Virtual Fighter! Yeah, they went so hard with the details for this, bro. This game is too ambitious. I keep saying this, but it's too ambitious. And it's gonna keep getting more things. 50 songs, bro. Next, let's discuss the details of the updates. Okay. We've made some improvements to battle arena. Oh! First, we're making it so you can send messages to each other in a battle arena. Okay. The messages are preset. That's cool. So there's that, and also the player who created the arena can now change the rules. God, like no more on making the arena. We've also added the, the option to play either battlefield form or omega form at random in the stage settings. Nice. So then we get both at the same time. God, like. Aside from that, God, like, now pick elite only as an arena type. Furthermore, quick play won't be the only way to play with people you don't know. Okay. As long as the arena type is set to public and no password is set, we've made it so anyone is now free to join. So I hope you'll enjoy that. Oh, that's cool! Terry is due for distribution on November 6th. If you have the Today. fighter's pass, you'll be able to get him straight away, or you can purchase him separately. So now? Well, Wait, like now, right now? Wraps it up. By the way, his reveal trailer was aired in advance. I'd like to show it to you after this. Oh, the reveal trailer. Okay. Now we're gonna get to see cool, cool trailer. Wait, who's that? Oh my god, is that Ken? Oh! Oh my god! 
Hey, come on! Wait, Harry Bogart's in Smash? Whoa! I didn't see that coming. At least they get out the way. Cloud Gate Body, two songs versus 50 songs, Omega. Oh! 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 Oh my god, he killed Snake. Okay! 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 Your Snake straight dead. I think that might be all, Chen. Oh, we crammed in a little too much content this time. Yeah. Hopefully, I'll be able to make future showcases a little shorter. Mm. He went hard, 45 minutes. All right, so let me get this straight. Do we do we update or switch right now for Terry? Uh, software update via the internet. Lul. <laughs> Lul.